that lucky and successful buyer. Folks, if there's been any other prior arranged terms that we're not privy to, please put your hand up. But if you have had a conversation with us about some other arrangements, other settlement terms, other deposit terms, and our vendors were agreeable to them, you're certainly more than comfortable to bid on that basis. Folks, number two at 85 at Mackey Road, Mulgrave, presents an amazing opportunity for you to capitalise on what is a buyer's market right now. A couple of bedrooms, a bathroom with cars facing to boot, underpinning a prospective purchase of really some of the finest soil that the southeastern corridor of Melbourne has on offer. It's low maintenance, it's fresh, it's tidy, it's sun-filled, and it's been freshly renovated for you to enjoy whichever which way you see fit. Whether you're looking to get into the market as a first home buyer, whether, whether you're looking to park your money in a sound investment, this is the opportunity that you've been looking for. Wonderful courtyard. Now, judging by the crowd that we've got in attendance here, you can see that the courtyard isn't in fact small. In fact, it is quite spacious and we are roomy here. Trying to socially distance, of course, but we've done our best. Not to mention we're also north facing, which is simply astonishing because you're gonna get the beautiful afternoon sun as well. Folks, the suburb of Mulgrave, well, we know it is by far, I believe anyway, and I'm sure you would agree with me, if we've got Mulgrave residents in here, by far the most underrated and undervalued suburb in the city of Monash. The amenities that Mulgrave possess are simply astonishing. Schools, public, private, secondary, primary, parks, reserves, public transport, medical facilities, cafes, restaurants, public transport, you name it. The list just goes on and on and on. And I'm gonna say it again, Audman, but this is by far the most accessible suburb in Melbourne, if not Victoria. We are smack bang between the CBD and the Bay. Unbelievable. You've got accessibility with freeways to either or within the same distance of each other. It is unbelievable. And this is why the median house price in Mulgrave and demand in Mulgrave is absolutely exploding. This is your chance to capitalise on the market, especially when money's never been cheaper with record low interest rates. So folks, without further ado, I want to put it in your hands now for your spirited bidding. I don't mind where we start the bidding for number 285, Mackey Road, here in the heart of Mulgrave. Who wants to get things underway? Opening bidder up up, where do we go from here? Don't mind where we start, folks. 530? Sure, at 530,000. Nice to see you at 530,000. It's always nice to get the monkey off the back and be the opening bidder. Now that you've placed the opening bid, you're going to keep going, aren't you? At 530,000, best of luck, you're coming in first place. At 530,000, all oh, but I'm locked to go in $10,000 rises, if that's okay. At $530,000 now, 10 grand to jump back at 540,000 now. Folks, we know we've got bidders in the crowd. This is the opportunity for you to jump in and capitalise. There's your competition down the front. At $530,000 now, 10 grand to jump back, folks. That's all we're going to search for at this point in time. Just a $10,000 rise. At five forty dollars to jump back. Bids down the front. At $530,000 now. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it. Here we go. We've got a fresh face in the race at $540,000 now. Ten to jump back. At five fifty. dollars yes or no? This is the opportunity. Need to know if you're going to jump back now. At $540,000 down the front. Strictly down the middle here. At $540,000 now. Ten to jump back. Fifty. Bang straight back. There it is. At $550,000 now. Gentlemen, time for you to jump back now. At $500,000. $160,000, you sure done. Finish silent now. What, you've come in for one bid and stop? Give it a crack at least. At $550,000 now. 10 to jump back is what we're going to search for at this point in time. At five sixty, dollars take your time. We'll give you every opportunity to think about your options. There's no pressure here. At $550,000 now. 10 to jump back. Folks, if there's any other bidders in the crowd, now's the time I need to know. Bids here, down the front, at five five zero. dollars Sure, done. Finish silent. Once at five fifty, dollars Twice at five fifty. dollars Third, final time, 60, straight back. Nice to see you. 550, got 550, 60. 60, 50 is the bid. 60, just confirming. Thank you very much, really appreciate it. Nice to see you at 60 now. Ma'am, at 70 to jump back. We're almost there, we're getting very close. At $560,000 now. Held that bid for an awful long time. Now's the opportunity to re-enter that process. At $560,000, down the back corner now. For number two at 85, Mackey Road here in the heart of Mulgrave. Five sixty to be against the brick wall there. Ma'am, over to you to jump back now. Ten grand to jump in. There it is. At five seventy now. Ma'am, over to you now. At $580,000 now. I've got two bidders fighting it out now. At $570,000 now. Gentlemen down the front, are you sure? 100% out. I want to thank you for your bidding today. Really appreciate it. At $570,000 now to the right-hand side. Need to stay in tens. I know you want to give me the five, but need to stay in tens. I promise I'll let you know the second that we can chip back to smaller increments. Bids here, down the front at 570 now. 10, 80, bang, straight back at $580,000 now. Are you sure? 100%, I get it, there's a line drawn somewhere. 
But think about your options here. At $580,000 now, 10 grand to jump back and you'll re-enter the lead. At $590,000 now, you never know, your competitor could be maxed out at that figure too. At $580,000 now, 10 grand to jump back at 90. 590 is what we're gonna search for now. Give it one last crack, give it one last push. You never know, it could be the victorious bid or at least earn you the exclusive rights to negotiate with our vendors. At 580,000 down the back corner. Are we gonna wrap things up now? 10 more grand, come on, give it one last crack. Once, at $580,000 now. Twice, at $580,000 now. Third, final time, we're gonna wrap things up. 10 more, come on. Wait. At 580,000, thank you for your patience, ma'am. I really appreciate it. At $580,000 now, 10 more, 10 more. Just let me know. Are you happy to take the five? Sure, at 585. Nice to see you again, you're back in first place. We're gonna extend the courtesy back there with another $5,000 rise. At $585,000 now, you're back in first place and it's nice to see you again. Right now, you're in the box seat to buy the property. How does that sound? Right. Sounds good, doesn't it? We're not there yet, but almost at $585,000 now. Bidding at auctions is a stressful process, I understand. You're going to hate me because I drag them out so long and I'm going to give your buyers time to think, but I promise you one thing, if they jump back, I'm going to extend the courtesy to you. I know you'd appreciate that if I was auctioning off your property. We're going to do everything we can to look after every single buyer here. At $585,000, you are in first. Gee whiz, you look nervous right now. At $585,000, at $585,000, are we done? Need to know, one more Audwin, come on, make it five ninety. dollars That's the number that I wanted to get to anyway. At five eight five to the right hand side, three chances to jump back now with a $5,000 rise. At five hundred eighty-five to be in, five to jump back at five ninety dollars now. This is the opportunity for you to jump in and regain the lead. Your opportunity beckons here for number 285, Matthew Road, in the heart of Mulgrave. No more searching, no more realestate.com, no more domain.com. No more filtering searches. No more price ranges between 600 and 800. This is the one you want. This is the one you're going to buy. Seen it, loved it, now buy it. 585 is the bid. Need to know. Once, we're going to wrap things up, Baldwin. Twice. Third. Final time. At 585. Done. Finished. Silent. Out. You sure? Gordon, we might pause just for a very brief moment, if that's okay. 100% out? Okay. We're just going to pause for a very quick moment. We're, We're very close. close. Thank you. Sure.
Folks, thank you so much for your patience, especially you, of course, holding the highest bid. We're awfully close. And when I say awfully close, I mean moments away from getting this unbelievable opportunity on the market. But I've got one, I've got no doubt in my mind that one way or another, the property's gonna be sold. There's gonna be a sold sticker on the board. Even at this particular price point, I've got no doubt that we're gonna have the happy purchases. We're very close. My instructions are that we'll be putting the property in the market in one or two bids time. We're very close. Legally, I can't give away more information than that. That's not allowed to. I wish I could but I'm not allowed to, but we're very close. We're one or two bids away. As I said, I've got no doubt we're gonna have some good news in a few moments time. I just need to know what's going on here. Is there more in it? I need to know, five more grand to jump back. Uh, 590 and we're selling. There it is, at 590,000 and we're selling now on the market. At 590,000 now, man, right now you're holding the keys, you're in first place. At $590,000 now, man, it's over to you. Are you sure, 100%? Because you know what? I'm happy to take anything you like. You're not gonna offend me even if it's a dollar. I'm going to accept it, I promise you, at 590000 because my job is to make sure that every buyer has had every opportunity, every opportunity. If you need time to think, that's fine, I'll just keep dragging this out. A minute? I'll give you 30 seconds, how about that? At $590,000, man, you're in first place. I want to thank you for your patience, and I've just got to do the absolute same here. We did the same with you a few moments ago. We're at $590,000 right now, and you're in first place, and we are going to be knocking the property down to you. We're waiting for our underbidders to see if there's any further interest here. Right now, they're looking at the veggie patch thinking, sweetheart, what could we put here? Because I reckon maybe we could put some, there's already tomatoes, I believe, that are in there, but maybe we could do some cucumbers, some zucchinis, and maybe some capsicum, if if we're lucky, especially this time of the year, at 590,000. Are we in or out? 30 seconds is up. What's going on? Once, twice, third, final time. Give it one more crack. We're going to sell. We're going to sell. Need to know. Are you sure? Out. At $590,000 now, need to know. Are you sure? Not even the veggie patch line got you over the line there. Are you sure? I want to thank you for your bidding today. You've been marvellous. If, if you're not going to continue bidding, it just wasn't meant to be the property for you. It means there's a better one for you. That's what I'm always going to say to my buyers, always. Thank you for your bidding today. They're going to help you find another property similar to this, maybe even better for you. Maybe. But right now, at 590,000, man, you've got yourself an unbelievable buy. We're going to knock it down to you. Once, twice, third. Sure, we're selling. Sure, we're knocking it down. Last chance. You're killing me, Auburn. <laughs> Man, I want to thank you for your patience. We'll do the absolute same for you for selling your property. My instructions to you to have your next bid ready to go just in case. One or even five, exactly. I was going to suggest the same thing. Makes no sense to back away at that number. You sure? The boss or you're the boss? She's the boss. Okay. The boss has spoken. Orvin, we're selling. Cool. We're selling. We're selling. So, congratulations. Well done and well for. Commiserations to Underbidders. Thank you for your bidding today. Have a wonderful weekend. Thank you so much. Have a great Christmas to everybody. Thank you. Congratulations again to our purchaser. Thank you. Thank you.